Welcome back, everyone. This is part two of Prey. So, I just killed about four or five mimics. So, let's continue on with and try to figure out why my brother is fucking with me. Take the transcribe. Let's listen to it. Robert? Alice, thank God. No one else is... Where are you? Hiding. I'm in the conference room. I can't... Jesus, you're still in the lab? I can't get out. There's... What the hell is security? Fuck coffee. I don't know what's happening, but Robert, you have to get out of there. Come to the elevators. Someone said we're evacuating. Robert? Shh. Hang on. Someone's coming. Now, I know there was another mimic here. And if you guys can't tell, I'm going to let you guys in on a little secret. If you can't tell, pray the original play, not this play, because the timelines won't match up. But play was one of the games that helped influence Bioshock. Not, I, I wouldn't say heavily influenced Bioshock, but did influence it. It was one of the influences to Bioshock. So, this is obviously the reboot, so this game obviously didn't influence Bioshock because it came out last year. So, Bioshock came out in 2007, but original play was one of the influences to Bioshock. So, let's see here. Position one, your knowledge of medical practices increased the effectiveness of medkits to 150%. Hacking, bypass level one security measures on computers and robots, robotic systems. Lovely drawn with heavy objects with ease and throw objects further. Thrown objects will damage enemies. Repair, fix broken grab shafts, uh, fabricators and recyclers with spare parts. And conditioning, increase your health to 115 and summon up to 105. One sneak, crime, and sprint 5% faster. So, this gives me firearms. This tree gives me firearms. The security tree. This will give me toughness to be able to take more damage and whatnot. More stamina. Increased movement. Uh, combat focus in a state of combat focus for 10 seconds in which time slows around you and actions cost 50% stamina that rankin rankins, lengthens this focus and lets me do more damage. Uh, combat focus durations increase to 15 seconds time slows around you, but you can move normally. Your attacks deal 125% damage. And actions cause no stamina, so that's pretty good. Stealth enemies take longer to detect you when you're sneaking or crawling. Oh, walk in one without making noise. Sprint without. Oh, nice. Do 200% damage in enemies while they are unaware of you. Well, I know how I'm going to play the game. I'm definitely going to take the stealth route. But let's see here. Materials expert. Rap tank. Impact calibration reduce stamina cost. <laughs> so <laughs> we have to do a lot of damage for a bench and be able to stealth around everywhere. Uh, of which three gunsmith repair suit modifications dismantle recover more valuable organs from Typhon's. Remains. Typhon organs can be recycled for exotic material, which is used in the fabrication of neuromods. Metallic boost doubles the both. Okay. Well, I spent like five minutes working at that, so it's time to move on. I already have a general plan. Ah. Oh. Everything you know is about to change. Well, yeah. There's something. Oh. I knew there was a mimic in here. Fuck you, mimic. Other people might not be desperate right now, but I'm definitely desperate enough to use the toilet for health. Okay, there we go. Feel fully healed. Work around here. What did? Really? 
I want you to take the crumpled piece of paper. Really, game? I don't need the crumpled piece of paper. Let's try to organize my inventory a little bit. Get all the important stuff nearby. And all the junk on top. Is that shotgun run? Yeah, shotgun shells. Okay, there we go. All the green stuff and blue stuff come. There we go. Get myself organized. There we go. Uh, how do I want to use the snow mod? That is the question. I can't get the stealth because I need two. The conditioning seems in smart engineering. Every, oops, excuse me. Yeah, I'll get the conditioning for now. That way we're a little bit safer. Oh my god. Really? Oh. Oh, yeah, that would I'm never. Sure there are many Transtar personnel who wish they had stronger, faster bodies at the moment. Now, let's get you to the main lobby. Yeah, I'm sure there is, but that still doesn't. Ex no, that still doesn't make. No, I still would never want to do that in real life. I mean, that transmod would have to. Neuromod will have to have some freaking amazing benefits to make me want to stab myself in the goddamn eye. That is ridiculous. I am sorry, but that is ridiculous to try to stab myself in the eye like that. Ugh. Gives me the heebie jeebies. Ugh. Sorry, throwing stuff away as I walk around my room and seeing trash. Things that should have been in the trash, but just not. A mysterious contact named January is guiding you to the main lobby of this facility. Do, 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 okay, now we can continue. You made it. Yes, yes, I did. Ready for your first real view of the world? Ho! We are on Tower S1, huh? So we are actually on the spaceship. We are on the spaceship! I would make another joke right now, but I don't think people will understand the joke, so I'm not going to do it. Jews in space! Okay. Anyways, I, I couldn't help myself. Couldn't help myself, and now everything I'm going to assume... Careful. You need to get to your office. I've updated your map. There's a video you need to see. I know you have a lot of questions. Shotgun shells. Yeah? I do have a lot of questions, but I also I'm going to like Attention. literally explore. Station leadership has issued an alert. All personnel should report to muster stations immediately. And what did you? No, fuck you guys. Fuck all of you. Fuck you. You stupid goddamn mimics. No. 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 Oh. oh, these mimics. These mimics are going to piss me off. Three mimics at once, really, game? Three mimics at once? Ooh. Can I repair my suit? My right. Right now... Okay. 
Get my suit back up there. I know that's probably a waste of the med kits, but. Oh, that's one med kit back. Hopefully, I'm going to be able to make some med kits. Here. Let's go around collecting any materials these has had. Screw you, headphones. Even though I'm wearing some headphones as I record this, so. Saying screw you, headphones doesn't make any sense. One second. I'm gonna change something because my one button on my keyboard apparently decided that it is not, I'm not good enough for it and it no longer wants to uh, work. So I'm gonna switch that to my num numpad one. So that way I can actually use it. Now, is there, yeah, there's a phantom in here. Quick narrow mod. I'm not gonna use that narrow mod. 23rd, 2025, oh, 1988, oh, 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 1964, 1963, a top secret Cold War negotiation. 1960, 1960, 1980, Where did you go? You can just, you can stay away from me, Phantom, for all I care. top secret Cold War negotiation culminates with Americans and Soviets working together on a research facility named... I know it was you, Mimic. You're not scaring me. You're not fooling me, Mimic. Oh, no. I am too smart for you, Mimic. I'm too smart for you. Oh. A top secret Cold War negotiation culminates with Americans and Soviets working together on a research facility named Kletka. Kletka, Russian for cage, produces the skeleton and core emergency systems of what will one day become Talos 1. Okay. 1964. After the attempted assassination of Kennedy and Khrushchev's departure, the U.S. pays for the rights to use Kletka as a testing facility. This period, known as Project Axiom, leads to many advancements in next generation materials and bioscience fundamental to neural modification. Okay, that's awesome. How did Kennedy live through the assassination? But whatever. I am. 1980 to 1994. Same. Geopolitical developments result in a temporary hold on Project Axiom. After the unfortunate Pobeg incident, in which two research scientists lose their lives, the Kletka facility is decommissioned and cleaned. I see. 2025. The Transtar Board of Directors is established. Transtar purchases and privatizes the Kletka facility with a focus on safety and state-of-the-art upgrades. Ooh. 2030. Talos 1 becomes fully operational, representing a monument of private space industry. The first Neuromod is released, allowing for dramatic enhancement to the human mind and body. Ooh. Hello, Mr. Kennedy. In memory of JFK, 19, 1917 to 2031. He's an old motherfucker. Holy how? How did Kennedy live so long? How? No. Oh, Mr. Phantom, you do want to play. Well, Phantom, if you want to play, you have to stay in the room as me. Because if you don't, I'm going to assume that you're jealous and don't want to play. Sit down, Phantom. That's what I thought. You just sit down. Oh, okay. Okay, I have... 1963. 19... I got mimics that are not happy with me. And this is why I didn't... Didn't like this game. This, this game is fully operational, representing kind of insanity. The private space industry. The first 2025, the 1980, 1960, 1980. Oh, okay, 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 okay. 
down here, get you down here. What's this? I know me of what. I don't want to use that Noah mod because that Noah mod is going to be used. Where is stamina? Okay, right there. Three, a top secret. I know Phantom is. I know more Phantoms are probably around. Ah, uh, no key card. Okay, can't go that way. I am nervous and scared because everything I know and love is probably a mimic. And I'm going to get screwed over by such mimics. See, there's a mimic right there. He didn't seem to notice me. So that's... That's a plus. That's a plus that that mimic didn't seem to notice me. Take that... God damn it! I'm, I'm just gonna hide right behind here. That's not a mimic. Okay, that mimic's dead. That mimic. Okay. Come with me, Mr. Turret. Come with me. You're gonna be my protector, Mr. Turret. Wherever I go, you go. Me and you are buddies. Eradicator auto turret version 0.7.6. Online. Wherever you go, I go. Exit from Aqua Stairways to Heaven by Dr. Andrew M. Allen. Early United States dominance of the first operational space elevator, the white Stork Tower has allowed them to control almost all orbital activities and commerce. Now that the rest of the world is playing catch up, the World Union of Space Industry, or WUISSI, has calculated that using the Stork facility to, to aid in construction of a second space elevator would result in construction costs that are one quarter of the original. Understandably, U.S. officials have balked at the idea of helping competitors build a cheaper platform that could give them a competitive advantage. Stark represents maintain, representatives maintain that the stable investment risks for the original platform justify the protection of this economic space. In the meantime, WUISI has aggressively moved to purchase ideal sites for future space elevators, a century space age squatting. Okay. Uh, fake news! Fake news! <laughs> Topical. Topical jokes. Thank you, turret. Like I said, me and you are buddies. Thank you, turret. There we I go. You go, Mr. Turret. I'm just going to sit right in here and heal up. I know this might be boring, but I don't want to use my med kits. Let's try to get this back to 70 health. Okay, I can't actually get healed from uh, that dude, but I do have some food. So let's do that. Coming with me, Mr. Turret. Coming with me. Find two health. I know there's a shotgun nearby that I can get. Uh, let's see here. Come on, Tur Turret. Me and you are best buds. You're Mr. Turret, and I'm I'm the noob that can't play games on, <laughs> on PC very well. So me and you are gonna be best buddies. Because I'm gonna need my hand held. Like 90% of the time in this game. It's just how it is. 
So let's see here. Continuing. Go this way. You rock my back there, turret. Uh, banana peel. I don't want your goddamn banana peels. Got some circuit boards and spare parts. Once again, nothing I nothing of great use. Come here, turret. Missy. Good morning, Talos. All personnel should report to their workstations for the day. If you expect to be absent for any reason, please inform your immediate supervisor. That's it. Fuck you, stupid mimic. How do I keep on getting biohazard? I don't want your biohazard waste. I don't want it, man. I don't want your feces. You know? That's all it is. It's just your, your poop. I don't want your poop. Stop giving me your poop. Thank you for the apple, though, game. That I will take. Get myself up here. Thomas, uh, anything else of use? Uh, some emails here. Okay, thank you. Viren Tearcode has got the key code for that. Okay, Dr. Ugi. I go. I will read your previous. Oops. I will relate your previous request and we see what you can, we can do, but there are no guarantees. The schedule for the visit is tight and may not allow for a face to face. I'll let you know when I have more details. Sincerely, Bikana, Talos One Volunteer, and Guest Liaison. <clears throat> Dr. Dewo Agu, Miss, Miss Goodwin. To follow up on the previous request, I was wondering if there have been any updates on Gaston's. Lintier's visit. It is still taking place, and if so, would it be possible to get a copy of his itinerary? I would love a chance to meet him before the narrow mapping procedure, if possible. Okay. Yeah, I again showed up. Quiet and polite. Quiet and polite. He shook Lintier's hand like he was afraid of breaking him, and asked him to sign an al album he bought. Lantern seemed frantic, so that was a plus. We tried to make him comfortable. His condition hasn't stopped him from craving a cigarette. Fingers were twitching. It's too bad. Such a talent. No wonder he wanted to get scanned. Helen. Do, 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 do. Uh, I don't know if I read that. Not a clue. Principles of Neuroscience, 10th edition. Except from Principles of Neuroscience, 10th edition, the brain was once... <coughs> excuse me. Considered too warm, wet, and noisy for seemingly delicate quantum processes. However, the discovery of quantum coherence in biological processes, such as plants and photosynthesis, avian navigation, and our own sense of smell, paved the way for the eventual discovery of quantum vibrations inside the micro... Tubes of neurons. Huh. Oh, how soothing. Paris. Scanning target, no typhon material detected. Well, I hope I never have Typhon material. Because then I will get absolutely... Absolutely fucked in the ass if I did. Key code change. Jason meant screw the... Screw the pa key co pad to my office. Had them set it to 450451. I'll be in swim labs a while, so you'll need anything, help yourself. Okay. 
We have the two turrets. So I'm should be pretty safe to walk into this room. I should be pretty safe for whoops. Zero four five one. There we go. My office. Hooray. Welcome back. This has been your home for the last three years. The video should be on your workstation. So I've been in space for three years, but yet have been living as if I haven't been in space at all. What the fuck? What the fuck is wrong with my brother? No, honestly, what the hell is my wrong with my brother? And what world did he think this is okay? Honestly, and what world? That's this not even white man. It's not even right what he's dead. Get me my junk. That's some synthetic and there we go. Get some nice bit of things. So what can I make? I can make a wrench. Of course. <laughs> I can make a wrench. <laughs> uh, that's kind of hilarious. Good morning, Morgan. I got the plan you requested. It say it is in your safe, Jason. Three neuromods. Awesome. So let me take care of my neuromods here. Because I just got a freaking three of them. That's kind of awesome. Uh, hmm. At the same time, oh, I have four neuromods. How do I want to do this? Okay, as much as I want to get all the things going here, these things are, all, are actually somewhat important. Upgrade your transfer uniform with extra inventory space and allow installation of two additional chips. Yeah, that is actually kind of useful as well. So now I have more space available to me, which is actually super useful so that's actually quite useful where is the utility watch me well okay i will get venture get to you i still don't know what happened I bet I put it behind me, but there's no reason we can't still be civil. You passed me in the hall today, and you worked through me. If you're angry at something I did, tell me, and we can talk about it. Pretending you don't even know who I am isn't going to help. We still have to work together. Michaela. Michaela. Do not disturb. Morgan, as requested, your terminal logs are set to be automatically forwarded to you, to your site and crew quarters, and the supplies from hardware setup. Let me know if you get to you. Oh wait, and if not, I'll get it resolved. And I made it. So what is... What is this watch... Watch me file, huh? Office for the view. Yeah, that that is... 
That is for certain. Hello, Morgan. Tough day, right? If I'm talking to myself, it must be. Now, your memory's shot full of holes. I know. I'm sorry, but it's permanent. So the first thing you need to know is you can trust January. It's an operator, a sort of backup of you and me. It knows what you've forgotten. We've been testing a new kind of neuromod based on the Typhon organisms, mapping their neural patterns onto ours. Problem is, when you uninstall a neuromod, it resets your memory back to the moment you first put it in. That's why you forget. There's supposed to be a process to bring you back up to speed between test runs. But someone could just skip that part, turn a single day into your entire life. Well, that's exactly what Alex did. The question is, why? You're not gonna like what I have to say next. And of course, how predictable. How predictable that they just magically like, fuck you. I thought I found every one of those damn videos. Sorry, but I can't let you listen to that. Not until I've had a chance to explain everything in person. For now, just... Damn it. I have to go. Just sit tight. Please. Sorry, Morgan. Alex cut us off from the Looking Glass servers. Time to improvise. I suggest you search Dr. Calvino's workshop in the hardware labs. He invented the Looking Glass technology. You might find a way to restore the server connections there. I'm looking for another way to help you in the meantime. Good luck. Okay. Now, I'm supposed to be supposed to get, be able to get a shotgun. I'm supposed to be able to get a shotgun. Uh, an upgrade kit. That's kind of cool. Ah, there's my shotgun. Oh, okay, there we go. I know me the boards. Okay, let's get some of this organized again. I have three narrow mods, so it's this. Break down equipment in your inventory into spare parts and recover spare parts from destroyed operators. That's kind of useful. But at the same time, being able to live is also kind of useful. So let me get the combat focus. That's kind of important. I do want to install the chip. Oh, okay. I just had to hit enter and apparently that worked. Okay. Whatever. That's how you wanna if you wanna do it. That works for me. Now I can press easy because I have uh Fuck you. Ha ha Dangly parts, stupid typhon. Don't want to use use it too much, though. Don't want to use it too much, though. Uh. Fuck you! Damn mimics! Screw you all! Get get back here, you goddamn mimic!
And now I have a pistol too, so awesome. Then we're going to take the suit repair kit. Use that. That's important. And let's... Good morning, Talos. As a reminder, all personnel must... Complete We're getting somewhere now. We're getting somewhere. Let's see here. I have a feeling there's a mimic over here. But then again... Everything I touch, I feel is a mimic. Honestly, everything I do, I feel is a potential mimic. I want to take the spare parts. Ooh, can I? And I repair this. Yes, I technically can. Uh, fix form bolts from the Huntress Boak alt caster. I don't have that right now. So let's take what materials we can get from this. Got some exotic, some organic, some synthetic. That works for me. And that screen is this born all to hell. And let's also eat the banana. Let's keep on exploring here. Keep on exploring. Sales division. Of course. Of course. Yeah, I'm going to take you down, Phantom. I am capable of hurting you now. Also, I'm also capable of running out of shotgun ammo. So, there's that as well. So, there's that. I have the ability to kill you and also run out of shotgun ammo. Ah, Jesus. Fuck you, Mimic. Jesus. Or give myself a heart attack. Oh, now I have the bow caster. Awesome. Sales folder. Excerpt from a telest... Han Star Sales and Marketing Intern Memo. Internal Memo by Peter Lonley. I don't think we have to worry too much about the side effects. From what I gather, it's just a little prick near the eye, right? I mean, it works scary, but I think if we can get advertising to push some of the more appealing pros of narrow mods, we can shift public attention from that. I'm not too worried about the red eye stuff either. I don't think any one person in the public sector is going to manage to get their hands on that many neuromides at one time, not at these prices. What I find far more worrying, though, are these reports of memory loss during neuromide removal. I mean, amnesia? Seriously? We can rewrite a person's brain, give them any skill we want, but we cannot avoid resetting their head back to the moment they got that shit and start if we decide to take it out? If this week's it kill no mod sales, doesn't matter if you need specialized equipment and training to take it one out. No one wants to risk losing years of their life just for their ability to speak French. This can't even go in the fine print. As far as as the customer is concerned, near mods are permanent. I guess he has a point. I guess. Ooh, ooh. Thank you, Neuromods. Definitely grab this one because I have the points for it. 
recover more valuable organs from Typhon remains. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to grab that right now. Because that uh, gives me more exotic material. More exotic material means better shit down the road. <laughs> Can't get food there. Get out. Trusty, trusty, trusty hair wrench. I almost said hammer there. I'm an idiot. I almost said hammer. There's more things to go do. But we're at 41 minutes here, guys. I'm going to end the episode right here. I hope you enjoyed part two of play. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next episode.